today on Nico's Kitchen. Sausage on a burger? You better believe it. It's damn good. We're making my sausage and slaw burgers. So first of all, we're gonna start on our sausages. So go out and get some good sausages. These have been flavored up with some parsley and garlic. So they've already got some nice flavors in there, but we're gonna to add to that in just a little while. But grab some beef sausages if you want to, pork, chicken, that part's completely up to you. So just grab your sausage, and what I'm gonna do is cut in half, but I don't wanna cut all the way to the bottom. Just open it up like that, so we sort of flatten the side out, and just again, just flatten it out with your knife, just until it almost resembles like a rectangular style burger patty. So just into a bowl, we're gonna make a really quick marinade just to rub over the top of the sausages. First of all, I've got some tomato sauce or ketchup. Next, I've got some barbecue sauce and also some sweet chili sauce as well. And just give it a good mix around, get those flavors combined and oh man, it smells amazing. Back over to our sausage. I'm just gonna brush that with that little marinade mixture there. And it just adds another dimension of flavor. You don't have to do this. And just flip it over and we'll do the other side as well. So just keep repeating this process with the sausages that you have and then we can cook them. So I'm gonna cook them on a griddle pan. If you wanna do them outside on the barbecue, that's fine, or just a normal standard hot plate will do on the stove. And I've just put some oil down on the pan and we're just gonna lay them down. So you just want to cook these because they're quite thin. They're only going to need about maybe two minutes to two and a half minutes each side. Now prepare the burger buns. Drizzle them in some olive oil and place them on a griddle pan or toaster until golden brown and set aside. To make the slaw, place in shredded green and purple cabbage, carrot and spring onion. Mix well and set aside. For our mayonnaise, place in whole egg mayonnaise, seeded mustard and fresh lemon juice. Mix well, and now all we have to do is put the burgers together and get stuck into these bad boys. Like I said before, I just think these are wonderful to use up some sausages that you got left over and to make them into the burger patties like we did. And that beautiful creamy mustard sauce on the bottom is just so good with this. And it goes so well with that slaw that we made with the carrots and the cabbage there. And of course that little marinade that we brushed over with the sweet chili, the barbecue and the tomato sauce really gives a nice glaze and caramelization on top of those sausages that we did. So this just works so well for me. Very, very simple to do, but different as well. So if you're looking for a different burger to make, you know, you've tried them all and you wanna give this one a go, please do, because it is different. It is packed from flavor from top to bottom, and I love them, and I just know you are as well. You're no good for me.